There are two ways to place a market order in TC2000. First is directly from the chart with our on-chart order ticket. Second is using a standard order ticket. Let me show you both. To place a market order using the on-chart order ticket, click the Buy button at the bottom of your price pane. Choose the second choice, which is to buy the symbol at market. This places an on-chart order ticket set to your predefined defaults. You can change the quantity of your order by clicking on the quantity button and choosing either shares or dollar value. Uh, we'll do uh, say 50 shares. It's a good till cancel order but we could change that to a day order. Notice that the bid and ask in our order ticket continue to update live and in real time till we press the buy button. And now we're ready to place the order. I click buy. This opens my confirmation order screen so I can review the order and then I click place order. You can see my market order was placed and filled and I now own the 50 shares of MPC. The second way to place a market order is with our standard order ticket. To use that, click the buy button at the top of your TC2000 and choose the second selection, which is to buy the symbol at market. This opens the standard order ticket, also set to your defaults. Again, you could adjust your quantity. Let's say this time we want $4,000 worth of the stock, and it'll set the number of shares to the closest number possible to that dollar value. It's a market order. Again, we can switch the duration if we want. Now let's make this a day order and then we click the buy button. It opens our confirmation screen where we can review the trade and click place order. We can see that it's placed my market order. I now am long 88 shares of American Airlines and you can see my P&L zones have now populated the chart on the right end showing my potential gains and losses from my current entry price. So that's the simple way to place a market order either directly on the chart or using the standard order ticket.